Uh, hello, everybody. My name is Mario, and I'm here to talk about our work. It's actually a joint work uh, between two labs, from input output labs, one in uh, the Edinburgh, uh, University of Edinburgh with Dimitris Karakostas and Aguilos Casillas, and myself on the other side of the world in, in Tokyo Tech, Tokyo Institute of Technology. Uh, I was going to say the blockchain labs, but maybe cryptocurrency labs is better. Yeah. Anyway, OK. Uh, First, a brief introduction to our lab in Japan. It was established last year. Uh, it, we are based in Okayama campus in Tokyo, uh, not center, like outskirts of Tokyo. And we usually we invite some people, uh, friends from, from the campus and, or, or abroad, some of you here that ha have already visited us. And usually like, we offer coffee. We definitely do not drink alcohol on Fridays. Uh, and there is also this word in Portuguese slang. Uh, um, Brazilian Portuguese, I know there's some Portuguese people here in the audience before they correct me, which means um, it's a slang for a, 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 a comfortable place, slightly messy, and that's how we like to see our workplace. And it's, it's, it, it's spelled, well, it's, uh, the, it's called Cafofo. And it, we have a problem actually, we're struggling to get a, a shorter name for, for our workplace, because if you've seen the picture, uh, we have a quite long name for our lab input output cryptocurrency collaborative research chair in English in Japanese in my opinion is even worse because it's longer uh, you could input output ango tsuka kyodo kinkyu koza is long so too, too long so we are trying uh, to get a word for that and which may be meaningless for most of people but for us it would be or for us and for a small group of people will, will people will understand it so we we actually we, we call our uh, office kofefe because it sounds like kafofo and coffee. And uh, well, so one of the work that we study at uh, kofefe on kofefe, I'm not sure, it's about uh, POS based uh, protocols. Uh, the, the, the idea, the problem that we are studying here is that in, in POS, uh, uh, in, it's in comparison to proof of work, we have this. Uh, the, the, the users depend to be selected to, to participate in the consensus protocol depends on the, how much coin they have it, and it's, it's, it can be harmful to the, to the security of the protocol uh, if not many participants join the protocol. And so, for example, it's so the consequences that the, the participants need to be online to do it, and maybe some people don't want to. Or or, uh, or or avoid it, or and so it's. In, but in principle, everybody who has a coin is supposed to, to participate. So one way to go out of this is uh, to to allow delegation. So if a node, a node has some coins, can delegate to some other participants to act on your behalf during the protocol. And as 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 some some uh, the consequence is that. Uh, there are some pools uh, that accumulate this stake. So that might be a problem because we have this uh, higher rate of uh, nodes who has most of the stakes. Exchanges also are a problem because it's a potential problem because they also naturally accumulate it. So from, from those, uh, those, those items, you can see that there might, there, 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 there's some problem, potential problems. And our goal as a, a research project is to come up with this list of requirements that, is, that uh, defines a good uh, POS protocol and also come up with a framework to, to tackle this, uh, all these issues. So far, we come up with this uh, list of requirements, about like uh, 14 items. And it is pretty much uh, the uh, no outline of what we, we have done. And we come up with definitions for assets and addresses, and also we associate addresses with attributes. Uh, and, and also, we come up with this idea of functionality for the security of what a, a core wallet would, would work and a generic protocol and some uh, constructions, two constructions to be exact. And also, we discuss some uh, uh, operation modes for wallets who, who we need to implement it. Anyway, uh, our research is online, not yet on ePrint. It's on the IOHK website. Uh, if you feel free to take a look on it. And yeah, that's, that's all I have it. Thank you very much. <laughs>